Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Goldcrest Valley 19. Uh oh. That's not what I wanted. Um it says widespread mode. No, I'll possibly be going out to the side like that though. How y'all doing folks? It's your host with the most. Maybe not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. I hope y'all doing okay. I am trying to figure out how to do the widespread. Um, and I'm having no luck. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Get back down. Toggle work mode. Oh, well, I had it. Left. Control and Y. Okay. Alright, now we should be good to go. Try this again. You know, I know why it's doing that. That used to be where the sheep pasture would be. And I bet it's, uh, doing that mishap thing but anyway we oh, got a good day I should have been out here about eight o'clock mowing but as you've seen in the last episode we was doing some uh combining some uh wheat we got this field here to do a uh, wheat and getting the grass off all this that's in this area um for, he said we can have all that for doing the tree work so I know we're not getting no money for doing the service but we are getting the crop money from the crop money from the hay and money from the trees so that's a pretty good amount of money and our semi trucks in the way tell you what well I'm gonna do is uh move that out of the way and I am getting really too close to that pole I keep forgetting about storage we have a silo here for storage I don't think it costs us anything to store it there it just costs us to sell it from there if that makes any sense but uh, let's see here. I'm going to get the combine started since we got this right here done. And I'll be back in a second, folks. Glad the train came by before I crossed that track. That would have been a mess. So I got to watch out. There's two trains. Sneak around this. But truck out of the way soon as soon as the combine gets back back 
cameras. Wow. Ooh. Well, folks, uh, I've been watching some of y'all's videos and stuff, and I saw uh, one of my YouTubers. He's got plenty of family members. Well, he's got more than I have. He, he's past his thousand mark, and he, he needs some help. He's got, you know, like I said, he's got the family members, but he don't have his watch time. Uh, to get monetized, and I was wondering, I can get a few y'all to go over to his channel and throw a tag in right here somewhere uh, to Ivan. And yeah, he he needs some help, folks. He's he's got the what? I mean the the YouTubers, the family members, but yeah. You know, kind of like me, you know. I don't think it'd take that long. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Don't take that long to get the family up there if I tried, you know. Really push the envelope a little bit. I think I reach out to more people. But uh, let, let's focus on him. Oh, whoa. I focus on this heel. But uh, go over to Ivan's channel if you don't mind and uh, send him some love and some watch time and stuff. Help a help a brother out, you know. Like y'all do me, y'all help me out so much. Um, my watch time ain't quite up there, but I'm not quite worried. Well, I am worried about it, but this camera's driving me crazy. Um, I'm gonna get there eventually, but just uh. The link's going to be down below in the description. Uh, if you don't mind, just go over and... If you don't feel like watching the video, just, just put it on play and let it play. Uh, that's, that's what I do. I don't know if it's right or wrong, but... If I ain't got time to watch a video or something, I'll... Put it on play and let it play through. So y'all can get your watch time and stuff. There's too many trees right here. I think I'm gonna jump on over that other little gap there. Um, but yeah, you know, some of them three, four hours long. I might get called out to a medical call, or a fire call, and I'll just leave it running. And, you know, try my best to comment something nice. And a lot of times, you know, it might backfire because I didn't watch it. But at least I'm um, letting that person get some watch time and stuff. So, uh-oh, uh-oh. Don't get stuck. Uh, oh, I'm on a wrong one. There we go. Raise it. There we go. Put both of them back down. Yeah, these trees was cut and this was leveled off. This would be good, but since it's not ours, not really going to worry about it. We're going to get what we can mow and be done with that. Good thing these things flex a little bit. How about here? Can I get past this? Yeah, that's a little bit better. Alright, let's go down these sides here without getting into the wheat too much. And also, uh, you know, Miss Sandra, 
She's been uh, doing pretty good. I need to send her some eggs. That way she can uh, don't have to go to the store in this hard time, you know. All right. Um, I guess I'm going to do a... Uh, oh, man, we don't have the uh, auger wagon over here. I got to get this grass mowed first, though. So, folks, I will be back in a second for y'all. I'm going to mow some of this. Because we really get it mowed so the sun can dry out so we make hay. So, be right back. All right, folks. This is the last load off of Phil 5. Uh, let's see. Got it on the wrong side again. There we go. Got three. There we go. Now, I don't know exactly how much this thing holds, but it's still showing two, three, four, five, plus these here. If I can find the thing again. Right there it is. And it's showing ready to outsource is 100% and I'm at 30% stored, so I feel we've got a lot more to go, hopefully. Um, got a few more straw bales to go and then the rest of it's going to be back over here in the hay. We're going to get it stocked up. For those that's just coming in, the little piece right over here, we're going to put a cow pasture. And yes, I hit the sign, folks. Here's your sign. That's how much hay we got right there. Uh, 17%, which is 148,000. So. Alright, um, I'm just going to shut this off. I'm going to tab around. I did buy this trailer here. And also, I need to tab. Um, as you can see, the tether's over there on our 4640. Trying to tend some of this, it wouldn't change or do nothing. So maybe it'll dry here pretty soon, or drying condition. Um, we get down there at the bottom plus sign, uh, twelve and uh, fifteen hundred. Then it's not drying at all. Then, uh, which is probably not time. And Wednesday, we got four more pluses. And Thursday, we got rain. So, uh, hopefully, it'll dry by then and we won't lose none by then either. Um, yeah, we're fixing to plow this up. Uh, we're going to plow it, line it, fertilize it, and then we're going to plant grass down everywhere. Then we're going to come in later and put our silo in and stuff like that. Yeah. Just don't know when the silo will be up. Our soybeans are starting to look beautiful. As you can see over there, I've been mowing over there, so yeah. And that levy should be ready to mow. And let's see. Let's go back in here. Check on our chickens, which they're doing pretty good. Uh what we got we got 56 now, so I've done made five in the past day or two. I'm um, going to auto save, so as you can see, when well, it's auto saving, we got um, here's the levy for it. Uh, no, here's the levy for it. This spot over here, about between 16 and 24, is ready. Our windmill area is ready. Uh, part of the train station is ready. We still got a little bit more. We're going to give it another try since we got another no more. And the square builder. And plus where our cows are going, it's ready in this area. So yeah, we got uh, a lot to mow. And also to check in, we need to go down here. 
we uh, borrowed the farmer's tractor and cultivator and we need to go which our next one uh, 28 30 28 and 30 on the cultivate so let's go ahead and start this up So let's go do 30 next. It's somewhat the closest. This uh, flint tractor don't look half bad. Y'all see that? Look like they try to pull me sideways. Uh, 939 Vilo. There should be a bridge here somewhere. Right here's the bridge. But I am going to uh, do these two contracts for cultivating. Wish we get this field here too. But it's that field and this field. Let's do uh, this one first. Let's start. Whoa! See, see what I'm saying? Just started spinning out here lately. On this bound anyway. I noticed the baler with that one tractor was kind of doing it on the ends a little bit. All right, let's go right here. I'm going to hire a worker. Uh, Andy. Oh. Okay. Sorry. Hit the wrong button again. Got lime in here, so this tractor is ready for that. Our bales are ready to be sold too. We need to do that. All of them are ready. Um, here's what I'm looking for. He's done with this field. We want to pick this straw up while we're waiting on our grass turning to hay. And, uh, yeah, front hopper's full. I'm just Trying to see how much we got left, so I'll be back in a second. Alright, folks, Maplefield Mill is the high spot right now. Now we got 63,544 liters. I think the two uh, gravity fed wagons, I couldn't think of what they was called there for a second, will be enough for the chickens. So we're going to put this in here. Maplefield Mill, you have to get to it by a train. Or at least that's where you had to on 17. So I don't know in 19, but we're just going to put it in here, put it on train, and go see. All right, why? I don't know if I can get where to pull up a little bit. If I switch to the back, well, there we go. I'm just going to leave the truck here and then uh, go find the train. Be back in a second. All right, as you can see, I'll stop the train. Well, they're letting it load us, what did I say, 53,000? It's not showing me the leaders, but it's showing me the bushels over here at the bottom. But yeah, we're waiting for all this to turn to hay, and you know, we're going to pick it up, make hay bales probably in the next episode. And uh, get the combine all cleaned up and ready for soybeans. And then uh, we'll have to order our cotton picker too. Uh, also, I still have another load of logs at the uh, sawmill that I haven't sold yet. So, uh, yeah. Okay, we are full. We're not full, but got what's on there. 
So I will meet you at Maplefield Mill. Which should be over by the hotel we did some work at over. So yeah, be right back. Alright, come to a stop at Maplefield Mill. Alright, stop right there. And we're going to go in here real quick. As you can see, Maplefield Mill. It's 1074. And here we are at the mill. And there we go. Make sure I got on the right one. Let's watch our money go up. And I'm going to go ahead and do the logs too in this episode. I got thinking about that. Uh, which it won't take very long. All right, 205. We got 19,368 off that. All right. I'll leave this bad boy here. It'll start on its own. I'll meet y'all at the sawmill. Be back in a sec. All right. Yeah, uh, you can see the last episode, I think, is when I unloaded that front one, so. Oh, oh, get, get back up, get up, get up. There we go. And do the strap. Don't know why it's acting like that, like it's trying to pull towards the machine. I would throw some out. Ah. But yeah, we gotta get a cotton picker, um, module uh, thing or something, or depend on what we gotta work with and stuff. We gotta buy that and uh, we'll way to load the, the cotton bales and stuff it's it's just so much folks that we gotta get but once we get it you know we won't have to worry about buying it no more we don't have to worry about upkeep oh there's a little top here See if I can get all these in here this time. Without making a mess. There we go. I'm going to finish getting the rest of these up. And then I'll come back with a total price. Which hopefully will get us to 250000 250, So yeah. All right, this is the last bit of logs here, and there's it, it more than what I thought it's going to. Uh, oh, we're gonna need that money, yo. All right, there we go. Scoop this back. We're gonna lower the boom down because we got to do some maintenance. Got to do some greasing and stuff, folks. Got to keep them greased. I have to get the uh, truck or something backed under there so I can reach them. All right, they should be almost done. Can we get to 300? Come on, make it to 300. Come on. Oh, $299,988. Is there another piece of log ring around here somewhere? Oh, well. It is what it is. But, well, folks. $300,000. Yeah. Oh, um, there's several other things. It, it, it's won't take long. Just take a second. I think tabbing through the vehicles is the hardest thing of all. Uh, our good little friend here, since we got the other tractor for our spray tractor, we are going to let this one go back. It's just, uh, it's alright, it's just, it's having some issues, like transmission trouble or something. So we, we're going to let it go back. They're going to give us somewhat of a pretty good deal. 98941 folks. We're going to sell. And like I said, we need the money. 
that brought us almost 400,000 folks um, this is our pilot for it and this is the thing to pick up some hay bales with uh, we're gonna be putting that on a front loader or something something like that that's to come and uh, this is gonna wrap up the episode so I appreciate y'all watching commenting liking subscribing if you're new hitting that bell and all the good stuff you know y'all are awesome folks I love each and every one of y'all. Um, I think I'm going to pay 98000 back to the bank. Uh, not to the bank. We, we don't have a loan. Uh, our loan is paid off. We, we have to pay the sawmill. Um, this guy's almost done with that. And so we got, uh, we got one more harvest to do on field 31. What is it? It's wheat also. I totally forgot about that. Yeah, we'll have to do that next episode, though. All right, folks. I love each and every one of y'all. Thank you for all your support. Y'all are awesome. Till next time, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. I'll see you in the next episode.